Hi everyone, welcome back to another DIY video. For those who are here for the first time, my name is Sarah Adnan and I'm super excited to show you how I made this DIY wall art at home. Now, I specifically used it to decorate my bathroom. However, you can use this idea to make a frame for any other room in your house. And just as a reminder, if you haven't already subscribed, please do so because I will be sharing a lot more DIY videos like this. Now, without further ado, let's get into it. For the artwork, my inspiration was driven from a Google search that I did on bathroom frames and I found this phrase super quirky as well as super relevant to the recent events where there's a shortage of toilet paper rolls. I'm using Adobe Illustrator to design the artwork where I've created a vector icon for the toilet paper and paired it up with some fun text. After saving the artwork as JPEG files, I just uploaded them into Cricut Design Space so that my wonderful Cricut can do the job for me. Now, if you'd like to see a detailed step-by-step -step process of how to upload images into the software and how to use a Cricut machine, then let me know in the comments below and I'll be more than happy to put together a tutorial for it. Now, let me show you what my wonderful Cricut looks like. It's basically a machine that cuts paper into the shape that you want, which you'll see in a moment. Just load the cardstock and the Cricut does everything for you. It's also super satisfying to watch it do its job and see how things get cut in such a nice, clean and crisp way. Now that the cutting is complete, I'm going to just peel off the cardstock from the board, which is the most fun part because you get to reveal what you just made. The Cricut comes with these boards that have a light adhesive on the surface so that the cardstock can actually stick onto it. I'm using a scalpel, one of the Cricut tools to peel off the letters and artworks very gently so that nothing gets ripped or ruined. Look at how clean and crisp that is. And here is the outline for the toilet paper. Doesn't it look so adorable? For the background, I'm using a white cardstock and measuring it as per the size of the frame that I bought, which is 11 by 17 inches. And then I'm just going to lay out the cut artwork onto the background to test how I'm going to position it before I can actually glue all the pieces on. I wanted to add a black border to the background as well, so I just cut out strips of black cardstock and used double-sided tape to stick it on around the edges. With my border in, I'm going to now begin gluing the artwork on. I'm using liquid glue that comes in the form of a ballpoint pen, which is perfect for dealing with delicate pieces. For reference, I've listed all of the materials that I used on this DIY project in the description below. Now it's time to put it inside the frame. I'm using a simple white border frame because that's the kind of aesthetic that I wanted in my bathroom, but of course you can use any type of frame that you prefer. And here's the final reveal. I'm so happy with how it turned out. And if you enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you next time. Bye.